Trailite here in Pirata. We've met Nancy and Lloyd Muller. They're from the Taranaki. They've just popped up to see how their new Trailite motorhome build is going. This is their second one. They've previously had uh, Coromandel and now you're upgrading. So let's go in and see why these guys are going for yet another beautiful Trailite. So we're going to have a look in. It's in the middle of the build. So Lloyd, you guys lead the way and let's go in and have a look at how this is going so far. And you can tell us about you what changes your... You oh, first time they've stepped in it. <laughs> right. Yeah. So it's mid-build. Tell us, what is the difference in this model to the one you've already had? The Coromandel we used to sleep above the cab. Yeah, so there was the big Luton bed, which yes, the trail lights correct. are quite famous for. They have the fabulous steps which, on the side. Yes, and it was a great, it was a great camper. I wouldn't have sold it if I didn't have a wife. <laughs> <laughs> but the challenge of getting up into that Luton space has yeah. just got a little bit too much. So. You've elected to go for the fabulous yeah, the bed at the back and the amount of storage that they pack into these is just fabulous, isn't it? Yeah, With all your drawers underneath and the bed pushes back yep. so that you have walk around space as we've just seen in the one I've just reviewed. So this is identical to that really, isn't it? Except you've got even more upgrades. We've got the TV in the bedroom. Right, I saw the fittings for that. So you actually you've put the TV in. Yep. What else have you done, Lloyd? Um, the automatic leveling system. So you're going to push a button and everything will just automatically level. level. And it's got the air shocks at the back, which lifts the uh, three settings, which lifts the chassis up. So if you're going a bit off road, oh, you can do it for comfort. Anything. Just for comfort for anything. Yeah. Yep. For ride comfort while you're driving, Correct. all that sort of stuff. Why was that important to you? Uh, it was an option that we were given, so we decided. To so it. yeah. What other options were you given? Um, How did you go with solar? Did you upgrade? Oh, yeah, yes, we upgraded the um, lit to the lithium batteries and an extra solar panel on top. So how much solar are you going to have on this? Uh, I, I'm not, I can't quite tell you that to be honest. Hundreds of watts. <laughs> plenty, Hundreds. Plenty, yeah. And how happy are you with the kitchen? Is um, a slightly smaller kitchen bench than your previous mm, one? Not really, no. Not really no. the same? You're really it's happy with the, the bench? Yes. yes. And did you guys have colour options and yes, things like that? How did that go? Did you sit with somebody to choose all your options? Michelle helped us to, um, to choose what we needed. What we wanted, yeah, and uh, yeah, it went pretty smoothly. Mm. So, this is the halfway stage of an interior build. Well, it's all just titivation from here, really. It just looks like a lot of work, doesn't it? it does. But it had all the main stuff's been done. Well, that's exciting for you guys. I hope you get to pick it up in the next month. Hopefully, we will. Have <laughs> yeah. That's it's great. Fun. Thank you so much for sharing a little bit of a story with our readers.
multiple drawers within drawers, magnetized to lock them closed, soft close. Bedroom, the mattress pushes back for daytime, creating plenty of space at the end here. Great size shower there. Beautiful Roman blinds over the large windows. Everything can be styled and picked to suit. Deep, spacious storage there. Wardrobe. Small storage door. The wardrobe. Oh, it's in there. Power and two USB chargers. And that's for charging two, I believe. I will check. And of course, there's even more storage underneath with the six large pull out drawers. Same on both sides here. I better put this bed back together. It was looking beautiful. But we'll just pop in here quickly and check out the bathroom. That isn't a twin bowl, it's a beautiful mirrored reflection. <laughs> Storage out in that corner. And of course your 12 volt electric flush toilet system. Underneath. Very nice. 